it's funny if it's not one thing it's another thing i do want to give a big shout out to good evening everybody and as you guys can see i got my sleepy face on but i am doing my infusion today is a very unique day it is a narcoleptic day once in a blue moon i have these days of i am very tired and i need to sleep the whole day is a sleeping beauty day once in the blue moon my narcolepsy creeps up on me and says go to sleep excessive daytime sleepiness is a real thing and today my body just wants me to sleep the whole entire day and it's i guess my body's way of saying sleep and some of you guys know how narcolepsy is or deal with a different sleeping disorder but with narcolepsy the best way i could describe it is sleeping for 30 to 60 hours and not feeling rested at all but i am going to do a mini vlog today and then go back to sleep and rest i need to catch you guys up on a couple more things like usual Ooh, that was a good yawn. Tell me how many of you yawned with my yawn, because yawning is contagious. So, I see all of you guys are asking me so many questions through the comments, and I have decided I haven't done a YouTube live in such a long time. So, why not do one Friday? Let's do one Friday. We'll do one on Friday. May 4th, oh, before Cinco de Mayo, May 4th at 7 p.m. Let's do it. I will set up a reminder on my YouTube channel so you guys can see that. It could be about any appropriate questions you guys have for me and Paul, about our family, about me and Paul's life, and my medical health. Let's do it. Let's talk because I miss you guys. I love our one-on-one -on -one conversations and you guys know our lives are so much fun and entertaining another thing is me and paul are going to be closing our mailbox i am so sorry guys um we will be closing it why because we're not really checking up on it i don't have the strength to keep up with it so i just told paul you know let's close it so if you guys want to send anything, one last thing, go for it. It will be closing in the next two months. So just to give you guys a heads up. Now, another question I see you guys asking a lot is, are you drinking a supplement shake? You should be, young lady. Drink your shakes. You need those nutrients. You need those calories. Of course I am. And like I always say, guys, you only see about 10 to 15 minutes of my day you don't see the full story you don't see my whole entire day like yesterday me and paul went to the movies it was our beautiful date it was awesome the movie was great and of course i took my shake with me and like i said in yesterday's vlog it is really hard still for me to eat and i'm taking it slow little by little baby steps and i was sipping on my shake throughout the whole entire movie and i'm very proud i almost had that whole entire shake throughout that whole entire movie hey that that's amazing for me usually i have one shake and it takes a whole day for me to have but two hours one shake that's an accomplishment but that's stuff you don't see in the vlog, so I'm proud, I'm proud. I know you guys ask these kind of comments just out of love and concern, and I really appreciate that, and I want to say thank you so much. But don't worry, I got my shakes on hand. I do want to give a big shout out to Kate Farms. We did get in contact with each other, 
and I did give them a background story of my medical situation and what's going on with me and they were so understanding. They gave me a trial period of oral supplements for me to try out and see how the shakes would settle in my stomach. So they sent me two different flavors, vanilla and chocolate, and we all know which flavor that I liked. Vanilla, of course. No, no. No shade to the vanilla lovers out there. I definitely love chocolate. I can't really eat chocolate right now. Like I said, it's just I'm taking it really slow with food. So I am drinking up chocolate like crazy. So the chocolate is a winner for me. And plus, chocolate is a woman's best friend. Let's be honest. I have been taking it very slow with these shakes and seeing how it does settle in my system. But the communication and how quick they did send them out to me was amazing. Also talking to the representative through email, there were certain things I didn't understand because they have their own lingo and I kept saying, what does this mean? What does this mean? and the representative had so much patience broke everything down for me and i loved it everything was smooth fast and easy i'm definitely loving these shakes even though it's taking me forever to drink it's funny if it's not one thing it's another thing that's what paul always says so if it's not my abdominal pain it's my narcolepsy and my narcolepsy is telling me go to sleep just sleep go to la la land and i'm like all right and today was the day i wanted to do a couple things around the house and nope not having it what am i gonna do that is something about narcolepsy i have heard multiple times people downplay it saying oh that's all you have to do is just sleep that sounds amazing i would love to sleep more no, I'm sorry. Honestly, it's pretty bad. You could sleep all you want and you don't feel rested. You feel like a zombie. I'm about to sleep, but it's like a forced sleep. I want to fight it. I want to go do stuff. And yet, it's just, it's like something is forcing my eyes to close when I'm like, I gotta wake up. Leave me alone. I gotta do things. But you gotta listen to your body and this is one of the moments well guys i hope you're having an amazing day and if you're not climb into bed and put over those covers and just sleep it off just like what i'm about to do and do it with a smile because that's all you can do sometimes your smile is always beautiful so for now adieu and bye